All right, we're talking about the single leg RDL, one of the most challenging movements uh, to pattern and to learn, especially for a beginner, but also a great movement for loading the musculature of the hip uh, in the posterior chain. And so one of the things we want to think about when introducing a new pattern is introducing high level of constraints. And a high level of constraints means we're limiting degrees of freedom or limiting uh, the chance that the movement maybe goes in an unintended way. So we're limiting our degrees of freedom, increasing our likelihood of executing the movement how we would like for it to be uh, performed. And so one way that we can do that is by manipulating the environment or reducing range of motion or providing external cueing or environmental cues. And so this variation of single leg RDL, we're gonna use an elevated and kickstand variation to really teach our client um, how to start patterning the single leg RDL. So after teaching an appropriate hip hinge, what we're gonna do is we're gonna tell our client to put our foot right next to our box or elevated surface. Uh, we're gonna hit the hips back. At the same time, the chest must come forward. So hips go back, chest is forward. One thing that I should think about here is all of my weight is loaded through my lead leg. So if I was to pick up my back foot, right, nothing changes. You can even think about your back foot is pushing yourself over to your lead leg. At that instance, all I'm gonna do is press or, or, or uh, leave my arm fall down right to the, the kettlebell or dumbbell. And to initiate the movement, we're gonna press the ground away to stand up right, and return straight back down, making sure I'm not leaning back onto that trail leg. So again, all my weight is over my lead leg. I'm pushing the ground away. I'm not reaching with my upper body towards the kettlebell like this. So again, hips back, chest forward, push the ground straight down, double check, good. I'm loaded on my lead leg, press the ground away. Excellent, should feel glutes, hamstrings, again, Elevated kickstand RDL, excellent way to teach the single leg hip hinge or teach the single leg RDL pattern by introducing high constraints to limit any unwanted uh, degrees of freedom.